Here are 763 proofs that the Earth is not a spinning ball. Reason number one. If Earth was a spinning ball, then the train tracks leading from London to Manchester would look like this. In which case trains would be like, and then they'd be like, what? Reason number two. If Earth was a spinning ball, then time zones could actually be explained. And that would be silly. Reason number three. If Earth was a spinning ball, we wouldn't be in the solar system. We'd be in a game of hoops. Woo! Reason number four. If Earth was a spinning ball, I wouldn't be able to see Tokyo from my window. But I can! Reason number five. If you fire a cannonball vertically upwards, it'll land in the same spot, more or less. This is a good point if you don't understand what inertia is. Reason number six. If Earth was a spinning ball, fluid dynamics throughout the oceans would be completely different. The water would swash and swirl around, even though I don't read. Reason number seven. If Earth was a spinning ball, women would talk to me but they don't. Reason number eight. If the earth was a spinning ball, then planes would constantly have to dip their trajectory or else they'd just fly into space. So how come they don't? And don't give me shit about centripetal acceleration because I clearly don't read. Reason number nine. If earth was a spinning ball, the Mississippi would do this. That just wouldn't be possible. Reason number 10. If Earth was a spinning ball, then Brooklyn Bridge would do one of these. And it has reason number 11. If you put ants on a globe and then spin it, they'll fall off. Makes you think, doesn't it? Unless you read. Reason number 12. If Earth was a spinning ball, I'd have 5 million subscribers. But I don't. Reason number 13. If Earth was a spinning ball, then during the Red Bull stratosphere dive, Felix Baumgartner would have landed in the goddamn ocean. This is another good point if you don't understand what inertia is. Reason number 14. If Earth was a spinning ball, helicopters and planes could just hover in the air and wait for their destination to come to them. This is a really good point if you have absolutely no awareness of the concept of inertia. Reason number 15. If Earth was a spinning ball, then a cannonball fired eastward would travel a significantly shorter distance than a cannon fired north. This is a really fucking good point. If you're someone who has time to come up with 200 reasons as to why the Earth is not a spinning ball, but doesn't have time to read upon Newton's laws of fucking motion. Reason number 14. If Earth was in fact a spinning ball, then people would understand why attempting to contradict overwhelmingly proven classical fields of scientific study without having a basic understanding of such fields is no different to hating the Kentucky Fried Chicken Megabox.